notice that after removing your nail polish, your nails look yellowish and brittle. They peel or split easily. When the pretty polish color is removed, have you thought about what it leaves behind and why? Painting your nails may seem like an everyday innocent beauty routine, but inside those colorful bottles are some not so pretty secrets. Toxic chemicals are common in nail polish and there's often no way for you to know exactly what's hiding inside. The companies commonly don't mention the contents on the little bottles or if they do, they are so tiny that no one takes the pain to read them. The beauty industry is largely unregulated, allowing cosmetic companies to use any mix of chemicals they choose. Beware of the three poisonous ingredients called the toxic trio in nail polishes. The first is toluene, which is made from petroleum or coal tar. Toluene is used to help keep nail polish smooth. This chemical has been linked to issues affecting the nervous system with symptoms that include dizziness, headaches, nausea and eye irritation. To date, toluene has also been banned by the European Union. Second, formaldehyde. It's a skin, eye and respiratory irritant and a known carcinogen. Formaldehyde is used in nail polish as a hardener and a preservative. Number three, dibutyl phthalate or DBP. This is added to nail polish to increase flexibility and shine. This chemical, however, has been linked to reproductive issues and also has been banned in Europe. The chemicals are not only a concern for women using the polish, but also for workers in nail saloons who are exposed to these chemicals on a daily basis. Some might argue that occasional application of nail polish is only going to expose you to trace amounts of chemicals in levels too low to raise concern. But nail polish is just one beauty product that many women use on a regular basis. When you add the toxic exposures from nail polish, however small, with those from fragrances, makeup, body lotions and more, it can no longer be brushed off as insignificant. To avoid these harmful chemicals getting into your body, look for less toxic brands and formulations of nail polish as and treatment. Carry your own safer polish to the saloon. Limit polish used by children. Pregnant women should apply and remove polish in a well-ventilated area. Saloon workers should wear face masks when working with nail polishes containing toluene and if possible should only work with nail polishes that do not contain toluene. Rubbing petroleum jelly, vitamin E or a cuticle cream into the cuticles at night will keep them moisturized and promote nail strength. In recent years, a few major nail polish companies like OPI, Lotus and Sally Hansen have removed toluene from their nail polishes. Make sure the nail polish you buy has written on the label that it is toluene and DDP free. You have the power to change the direction this beauty industry is heading by demanding safe, truly non-toxic nail products and supporting only those brands that follow suit. So pick a pretty shade, paint safe and live super healthy.